I'm sure you guessed it guys that in this lecture we are going to use the trim mode and we're going to put on the dynamic trim mode see exactly how it works I would deselect from everything I restore the clip here I will go for the trim mode now I'm gonna press W and you notice it jumped now to the first frame of the previous clip and selected the edit point so let's select our in point here that's what we want to edit and I will start by GKL as simple as this if I press L it will start trimming here and there is the ripple effect if you notice and actually everything works as normal I can press K to stop it I can press K keep it pressed and press L and go in slow motion one by one to see exactly where I want to go okay let's say we want to stop just over here so I will release L cool then I can select the out point and do exactly the same I can use L and I can use J okay I can press K keep it pressed and go step by step or slow motion if you like okay I'm okay with that so it's exactly the same with the ripple effect I'm gonna undo all this now if you select the edit point and you go L or J it really doesn't matter it's gonna go and do the role as usual nothing is different here from the selection mode I will undo all this now if you select the whole clip then the selection here of slip and slide is important remember that when you are in the three mode you can slip and you can slide okay we remember that now let's try it with the dynamic mode selected the clip I'm gonna press L and see exactly what's happening notice it is really sliding but also it is editing the previous clip and it's rippling it if you had one on the right it would have also rippled it towards the right if you use slip you know very well already that is gonna slip the clip and you're cool you will doing you know some uh, very nice editing in slow motion I'm gonna do it in slow motion okay and let's stop it just over here I hope you have all the courage now to come and mess up as much as you want with the dynamic trim mode and really have fun guys before you start editing because when you get very serious in video editing it's not fun anymore it's really a serious job it's not like I don't know after effects or other programs where you can play around this one you need to play now have your fun and later on will get very serious actually you will have to do your assignment thank you very much for listening I will see you in the next lecture